I love my sister. She's the most interesting, most pretty, most awesome girl in the whole world, and I love her to death, you know? And that's why it's important, because, I mean, look at us. You know, like, she's like the female version of me, you know? So if, if not being there for her is not being there for myself. I just wish I could do more to be there for her at all times. The first time I went to the support group, I bawled like a baby. Don't get me wrong, I cried during Avatar, but, like, just to hear them stories, man, it makes you look at things differently. Like, these, like, some people, they're confidential, you're not supposed to say anything, but, man, I've heard some gnarly stories that kind of just broke my heart in a million pieces. But the cool part about it was, as soon as I cried that first time I got it out, it was cool. And then everybody accepted me, we all hugged, and it was good for me. But it did mean a lot, just because, like, she really wanted me to go, and then when I went, like, I grew from it, too. You know what I mean? So, like, we all... We got closer and then we met a bunch of nice people, so it was just awesome. I've learned that recovery is, you have to have support. You know what I mean? Like, if you want to get better, you have to have people that care and love about you and that are there for you. I have somebody that always has my back. You know, no matter, I mean, support group or coming to the thrift store or, you know, going to dinner. I have someone that I can always talk to. And that is, like, the first step of recovery, you know, is having someone who's always there for you, who will always take time for you. I think if someone doesn't have a family member like I do that can help them, that can be there for them, they can always go to support group because my brother's been a big support to the people at support group. Like, let's say even if they aren't your family, by the end you are hugging them, you are getting to know them, and you can go week after week and still get to know people at support group. So if you have nobody, go to support group and there's someone there that'll listen to you.